Hey there, I'm Chris Ponick, Certified Public Accountant, Certified Coach, and the host of the Mastering Your Small Business Finances podcast. And I want to welcome you to this new series that I'm doing on this podcast. My intention is to drop one of these additional episodes every Monday while I continue to provide you with the regular Mastering Your Small Business Finances podcast episodes, which will continue to help you take control of and understand your business finances with topics that ultimately impact your bottom line. I have many business owners, accountants, and other high-stress professionals who listen to this podcast, and I want to get more help out there for individuals like you when it comes to mastering your mindset. I'll be taking a few moments each week to touch on topics that many high-stress professionals are dealing with and provide solutions to help you increase your overall well-being. Because I know your time is valuable, just like the Mastering Your Small Business Finances podcast, my goal is to keep these episodes short and straight to the point, but full of useful information to help you succeed in not only your professional life, but your personal life as well. How often do you find yourself short on time? Our lives are busy, and when we find ourselves with more things to do and not enough time to get it all done, it forces us to prioritize what matters most to us. Wouldn't it be great if you had the time to do everything you wanted to do? One of the things I work with my clients on is making sure that they're doing what they truly want to be spending their time on. When you look at everything that you're currently doing, how much time are you wasting on things that aren't important? A priority is something that you consider most important in your life. It's what you decide you'd like to do over and above anything else. I'd like you to think about what you consider priorities in your life. What is the most important thing in your life? How much time do you devote to this priority? Do you wish that you were spending more or less time on this priority? Do you think that you're spending enough time on your most important priority? If you're not sure about what your top priority is, a few examples of my client's top priorities are their health, their family, their job, and even their finances. Just because you've chosen what your top priority is, It doesn't necessarily mean that you have to spend all of your time on this one priority. You could have a high priority on something and find that spending a few hours each week on it is plenty of time. You may also find that your priorities change throughout your life. You may have had a job as your top priority and after getting married and having children, you may then change your priority to family. That's not to say that your job isn't a priority of yours but it may not be your number one priority. If you'd like to continue listening to the rest of this podcast, I invite you to sign up for my free private podcast, where I do a deeper dive into this topic on the Mastering Your Mindset Moments podcast for high-stress professionals. When you're busy working in a high-stress profession, it's often hard to accomplish what you truly want in your life. This private podcast offers solutions that you can immediately apply to your life so that you can not only achieve your goals, but increase your sense of purpose, satisfaction, and lead a more fulfilling and enjoyable life. You can sign up at financialadventure.com slash private to hear about the solutions that I provide on this topic. I'll post links to this and other valuable resources for business owners, accountants, and other high-stress professionals where you're listening to this podcast.